What's up, what's up? All right, we just got back from uh, Jeepin' with Judd 2018. It was held at Bartow, Florida, Polk County. Awesome event. Shout out to the Orlando Jeep Club for putting this event on. Uh, they've done it, I wanna say the last four or five years. This was our second year attending. Uh, they did an awesome job with the lines. There didn't seem to be a long wait. I know last year some people were complaining about it on the on Facebook about how long the lines were. This year they did an awesome job. So shout out to the Orlando Jeep Club. Uh, Fox and I are thinking about joining the Orlando Jeep Club even though we're from Jacksonville. They do events all over Florida and up in Georgia. So that's something that we are highly considering. I know there's clubs here in Jacksonville as well that we are looking at, but definitely or strongly considering uh, the or Orlando Jeep Club. Met some really nice people out there and uh, you couldn't have asked for a better event. And like I said, the lines were not long at all. They were going every 30 minutes. So you could realistically get off one trail or one course, turn around and hop on the next one with just a little bit of weight. So uh, great job there. The vendors, awesome. Uh, bought some stuff uh, real quickly. Got a couple of D-rings from 4x4 parts. Uh, was looking for these. Great price on those. I just need to get the plates for the bumper now. Uh, and then I can install those. Also picked up the D-ring isolators. I wanted to get some yellow, but unfortunately I got some green. Got these from Jeepers Den. So I'm going to email Jeepers Den and let them know I picked up the wrong color and see if I can... Uh, trade them in for the yellow because Minion Fet is, is yellow. So um, that's what happens when you're colorblind and you don't read the package where it says green on it. So I'm uh, going to email Jeepers Jet. Hopefully they can hook me up with that. Also, got to talk to Donnie again from Bartek. I'm going to tell you right now, their products are unbelievable. He hooked us up with a couple of the uh, water bottle clips. Thanks, Donnie, for hooking us up with a couple of these. I'm going to tell you, if you need anything from grab handles to seat belt covers to fire extinguisher holders. I also picked up a, a holder for my flashlight. Definitely go with Bartek. Bartek is unbelievable. Uh, the, the staff, always friendly. The staff is great. Um, and like I said, thanks to Donnie for hooking us up for these. Uh, and got a couple of those. Um, and that was about it as far as purchases are concerned. Was hoping to get the the plates for the bumper so that I can hook the D-rings on there, but uh, no one was selling them, so I'll probably go buy 4x4 four by four, four by four parts uh, and have them order those for me. The event was awesome. There were a total of 10 courses and trails combined. Fox and I went out and did two stock and one intermediate Friday morning. We decided to get the stock courses done uh, Friday morning because Saturday they get a little bit busy. Uh, we went to the show and shine Friday night, Saturday morning we went out, we did two of the intermediates, repeated one of the stocks, and hit the sandbox. Now the sandbox, we had all to ourselves. Eight o'clock in the morning, no one else on the course. So we were able to do whatever we want. Fox, I think, had a little bit too much fun uh, with the uh, sandbox and the Falcon, but hey, it was definitely worth it. So I'm gonna upload those videos. They'll be a little bit long, but they're going to be on each of the courses or each of the trails that we did, including the Sandbox, uh, Vendor Alley, and then also the Show and Shine. So I hope you enjoy those videos. Sit back, relax, and watch them. You can do it while you're doing paperwork or just chilling or, or doing absolutely nothing. So I really do hope that you enjoy those videos. Please like and subscribe. Uh, it'll help my channel out. Peace out, and I'll catch you on the flip side.